What if text prompts enabled anyone to make any type of movie? Or even an entire box set? That's the promise of AI. Someone will make a movie just with your phone that will be watched by hundreds of millions of people. So, could this become the future of the movie-making business? In the great movie studios, complicated... In the country that popularized film, a new generation of startups believe they are laying the foundations for a massive disruption to the movie-making world. Let me show you how it works. I'm gonna start with a simple one, which is text to video. By using generative AI, companies like Runway can create videos in seconds that would normally take a visual effects artist days. Let's do a sky with clouds. I can choose directions on style or um, cinematic choices or angles that I wanna preview. I really like this one. It seems like the, the light is coming out of the clouds. The AI is taking that image and now generating a video out of that. The AI is basically able to take that language and create consistent, realistic, and accurate videos that represent what you're writing. You can see now the clouds are moving, the sky is turning a bit dark, a storm is coming. These are short clips of four seconds that I've just generated the text, but I also put them together um, in a small clip. So let's see how that looks. The AI is able to predict how objects might move. You can specify with a brush what objects do you want to move within that picture. So in this case, I will select just the sky, and you can see now the sky is moving. I can select the boat, and now the boat is going to move as well. I can select here a person walking down the street, or the smoke from the cigarette. Or how things look from different angles. In director mode, you can move the camera almost like a video game. Top, left, down, up, zoom in, zoom out, and use that as the starting point for any story you want to tell. The AI also allows actors to be transformed with a click. You can use it for generating different worlds, basically any world that you want. So here I'm in my office in New York, but let's say I want to go to an enchanted, fantastical world. So just clap my fingers like this, and I'm now using this video plus a text prompt to transport myself into another world. I can go into an anime world. So I can do and switch between different universes just by using AI. Runway is one of a number of companies hoping to make AI integral to the future of the movie business. So how long will it be before your local multiplex is showing feature films entirely generated by AI? Or producing an entire box set for a streamer? Runway's founders are reluctant to give a time frame but they believe it's a case of when, not if. Someone will make a movie just with your phone that will be watched by hundreds of millions of people. It's gonna change the landscape of filmmaking and the landscape of cinema. However, it is still early days for this technology in the movie business. So far, perhaps Runway's most high profile use has been enhancing scenes in big budget films. Like the visual effects in this scene from the Oscar winning everything, everywhere, all at once. Outside the commercial mainstream, artists and filmmakers are experimenting with shorter films. Like this one about loneliness, directed by Paul Trillo. What if we took different routes, and if we took our time at different times, then maybe things could have been different. When it comes to blockbusters, AI may be best suited to taking over genres like animation and sci-fi. But what about realist films, such as historical epics? Generative AI has yet to master the photorealistic video these kinds of films demand. Some of AI's output can look more like Salvador Dali than Martin Scorsese. I do love that money, sir. <laughs> <laughs> We're still at the very early stages of this technology. It's only a matter of time until you get to a point where you won't be able to distinguish live action from generated video using AI. With Google and Meta also working on their own text-to-video generators, AI could one day prove as transformative to the movie business as sound, color, or even the invention of the camera itself. The camera was one of those moments in time where a technology and a scientific revolution 
creating a new art form. We're at that rare combination and moment in time where we're about to see a new kind of cinema being born. Of course, a world where video is made by giving text prompts to machines is not for everyone and may sound dystopian to some people. There are fears that AI could wipe out entire livelihoods, maybe even replace the human stars of the screen themselves. They can take your image and do what they want with it. AI... But those in the business of AI argue it could unleash new kinds of creativity in movie making. You're not going to become a painter just by having a paintbrush. You're not going to become a filmmaker just by having AI. The core aspect of the creative process is still about experimentation. And these tools are tools for experimenting way faster than ever before. By making film production more affordable, AI could make the business more accessible and democratic. There could be fewer Hollywood Nepo babies and more opportunities for outsiders. AI will change who gets to make movies. More people out there will have the power of perhaps what big Hollywood studios only have today. And so the most important change will be, for me, who gets to tell stories and what kind of stories do we get to watch and see. Hi, I'm Tom Wainwright. I'm the tech and media editor of The Economist. If you'd like to watch more about generative AI and the entertainment business, please click on the link opposite. And to watch more of our now next series, click on the other link. Thanks again for watching and please don't forget to subscribe.